Good day everyone, this is Alvin again from the Philippines and welcome to my day one standouts for Miss for the 71st Miss World. <laughs> Welcome. So as what I have said earlier on the video that I uploaded this morning, um, today is the first day of the 71st Miss World competition. And although some of the candidates are still on their way, m many candidates are already in India and some of them have already checked in the hotel that is sponsored, of course, for to be the home of our candidates. And after watching each and every candidates all of the updates that they have given it is time for us to do a countdown on who's the winner for our day one of the 71st miss world but let me just remind everyone that this top 10 is picked only from all of the ladies that have released their updates that have posted something about day one and also those who have already in the venue so those who are still on their way were not in were not counted in this ranking. So here are my top 10 winners for day one of the 71st Miss World and see if you agree with my list. Starting with my number 10, the Philippines. Gwendolyn Fornial. I felt like the dress looked a little bit stiff from my view. However, I still love how Gwen looked in these photos. I mean she looked amazing, she looked stunning and I believe that hot pink is one of the colors that really brings out the fire in her and this is what this one just perfectly fits the spot very very well she just looked beautiful and she was confident wearing it and that's what matters number nine goes to Nicaragua Mariela Ceros I know I haven't talked about a notice Nicaragua before but she looks stunning on day one I love her choice of outfit the printed pink floral details on the black fabric just looks so beautiful and I love how she changed her hairstyle to this because her look became more solid and she looked a bit stronger in terms in aura wise as a contender. Number 8 goes to Morocco. Sonia 8 Mansour. In fairness to Morocco we have to give her credit for going all out on the first day with her choice of look and outfit which of course pays respect and tribute to the Indian culture. Aside from that, she has performed a very quick dance which I think was great and I didn't notice her much before but wow, she actually looked gorgeous. Number 7 goes to Venezuela, Ariagni Dabuin. I really like Venezuela's look and she looked much much better than expected. Her look today was also something that I would expect from a Miss Venezuela. She took risk, she made a statement, she goes for the unexpected ones and chose something that truly catches the attention and she ticked all the boxes. That's why I'm impressed. Number 6 goes to Vietnam. Who in my phone? Vietnam looked super cute and so adorable in her bluish, lavender-ish choice of dress. I love how it gives a very classic and regal look and she looked absolutely gorgeous. I saw a group, a group photo with her in it and she just easily gravitates your attention towards her. She knows how to catch our attention and absolutely beautiful, beautiful contender. Number five, Peru. Luciana Arellano, Peru certainly did not disappoint and made an interesting start for the competition. I love her choice of outfit and she ra and I believe with that outfit she just radiates in it. I am 60-40 when it comes to the gold top with the 60% liking it, but overall she looked gorgeous and one of the best I've seen today. Number 4, Turkey. Norsina Sai, she looked divine and her look just left me speechless. I am just impressed with her by her beauty and the aura that she radiates. I mean, if she looked like this on day one, 
but more on the next days to come and on the finals. Turkey has started the competition at a really good spot and hope that this making waves in the competition would continue to build up until the best moment hit at the right time. Number three goes to Colombia. Camila Pinzon, my goodness, Colombia's look today just blew me away. I saw a good photo with her in it and she just managed to stand out and her aura is just overpowering and commanding, which is perfect. I also love her styling because it just gives the right amount of extra just to make us wow. So Colombia's look is incredible for today. Number two, the Czech Republic. Kristina Pishkova. I am obsessed with Czech Republic's look for today. The pink dress just gives us that Barbie vibes and it complemented and fits her perfectly, especially when it comes to her beauty and overall look. She looked stunning in it and I love the details and the design of the dress. Absolute perfection from the train to the very sweet neckline to the details of it. I love it. Also, adding that headband made her look even more adorable. So I personally freaking love it but my winner for day one of miss of the 71st miss world goes to let's see if you'll agree with my winner botswana let's say go shambo my winner for day one is obviously botswana i think this is a very solid win because she looked ravishing i love the white dress with fur in it and I have seen a video that I wasn't the only one who's loving it because even her fellow candidates are loving her outfit too and are obsessed with her choice of dress too. So we all are. We loved it. It's a very good choice for La Sego on day one. That is absolutely impressive. That's how you make an impression at the very, very start. I also love what she did to her hair because it truly emphasized her beauty even more. And oh my gosh watching different videos with her in it just made me love her even more because her bubbly personality and energy just can win our hearts over easily she won mine today and that's why she's number one so that's it these are my top 10 best looks for day one of miss world with botswana as my winner for today so do you agree with my list and is your favorite in the list or do we have the same winner for day one so don't forget to leave your comments below and by the way we will be doing this daily except on the day that i will be releasing a leaderboard so do you agree with my list don't forget to leave your comments below don't forget to give a thumbs up and share the video as well and most importantly don't forget to subscribe because you'll be seeing more of this videos in the future for now thank you very much and have a wonderful day from the philippines